we have a horseshoe. That was heaps of hard work. But that's pretty cool. Hi guys, I'm out in the bush again today. My first spot that I wanted to go to, there was someone parked in, so I've moved a bit further down the road. And where I've got to, it's really overgrown, but um, I remember from past times panning that I've walked past a few what could be mullet heaps, so I'm gonna try and see whether I can find them, and if I can, I'll have a bit of a detect. I've got the SDC in the backpack, so hopefully we come up with some cool results today. There's one little depression in here and a bit of a spoils pile, but it looks all just dirt and clay, so I, I don't think that's what I'm looking for. I'm gonna keep walking a little bit further because I reckon this will be too deep detecting. We'll see whether we can find something showing a bit of gravel. Okay, I've come across some gold workings. You can see in the, the distance, there's a little mound over the back here. And just behind this tree, there's a bit of diggings, which I'll get over and show you. So I found some more indications of workings. I'm not sure whether it's the gold workings I'm looking for, but um, there's a bit of a trench dug through there and a couple of holes. So I'm gonna have a detect around here. It still looks real dirty and muddy to me, but there's a couple of bits of quartz on the ground some rubbish as well but this is where I'm gonna have a detect otherwise I'm gonna run out of daylight got my first target there's a big one over there top of an old bolt not sure what this one is it's a bit of metal but um it's got a funny shape to it, flat edges. Magnetic. Something's jumping out at me. Uh, I say that. Big old square nail. Lead ball. Another loud signal in here. We have a horseshoe. That was heaps of hard work. But that's pretty cool. Small bits of tin. Metal bolt. Square nail. Square nut. Bit of lead. Thought that was gold to start with. A tiny little bit of rusted steel. A sharp bit of steel. Oh, now we got something rusty. Half an old nail. Piece of lead. Piece of barbed wire. 
That's what this will be too. So I'm going to leave that loud one. Lead bullet. Well, that's going to be my last target. Unless I get anything cool on the way back to the car and I'll show you my finds then. So I've stopped me a little hike back to the car to show you me finds. It's starting to get a bit dark. But heaps of rust today. Big bits of old bolt. Bits of square nail. Bits of lead. That's good condition now. I'd say that's probably the bottom of one as well. And then we've got a few little lead targets as well. A couple of bits of tin. A little bullet. But really, not much. As you can see, even around me, it's all just heaps of overburden. Makes it really hard to get much depth out of the detector. But it was nice checking out this area. As I said, I've walked through it a few times to go gold panning, so I was really happy to, to have a bit of a detect today. I just thought there would have been a few more relics or I'd be able to find a bit more gravel on some of these mully keeps, but it wasn't the case. But you can't always have a successful day full of gold. I nearly forgot the horseshoe. They didn't bring me any luck, but it's an old one. It's almost starting to thin right out. So I'm all finished up for the day. Didn't get anything spectacular, but that's just the way things go sometimes. Just have to do a bit more research, try and find a bit shallower ground in this area. As I said, there's been a few good results with the pan down here, but I was just hoping to find a few more gravelly runs along the hill coming off some of those mully capes or the where the ancient river lead that they were following. But not to be. Thanks again for watching though. All the support's been really, really appreciated. If you want to see some more videos of me using the SDC or the Equinox or out alluvial prospecting for some gold, head over to the channel, subscribe, hit the like button and turn on notifications. It all really, really helps the channels and the videos. So thank you very much guys. I'll see you next week.